In this lesson number three, we are going to solve five different questions on the topic syllogism and all the five different questions, the conclusion that is going to be based on possibility. So possibility can also be called as can be or otherwise question mark. So friends, listen carefully. In lesson number one, we have seen some of the conclusion that is based on some and all. And lesson number two, we have again solved five different questions and all the five different questions were the conclusion that is based on no. So in this lesson number three, we are going to solve five different questions and all the five different questions were the conclusion that is going to be based on possibility. So friends, listen carefully. Lesson number three and lesson number two, always you need to compare both the lessons because lesson number two opposite is lesson number three. So friends, listen here. In lesson number two, what we did is if we find a no conclusion, we used to draw basic diagram and we used to draw possible diagram. And if it is false in any one diagram according to no conclusion we used to say it is false right so friends listen in lesson number two i have clearly told that if it is false in any one diagram then no conclusion is false but according to lesson number three if it is true in any one diagram possibility is true that is the difference between possibility and no so friends listen the concept carefully if it is false in any one diagram no conclusion is false if it is true in any one diagram, possibility is true. If it is true in both the diagram, so possibility is true. If it is false in both the diagram, where well, possibility is false. So friends, which is most important. So listen carefully. When we go for no conclusion, if it is false in any one diagram, then the answer is false. But when we move on to possibility conclusion or can be conclusion or question mark conclusion. So if it is true in any one diagram, then the answer is true. So if it is true in both the diagram, again, possibility is true. When it is false in both the diagram, then possibility is false. And another important thing while solving lesson number two, I have told you one note that second note. If all the parameters are inside a single Venn diagram. So friends, listen carefully, assuming that A, B, C, D. Right. So, assume that there is a some question and we have drawn the Venn diagram for that question. If all the parameters are inside a single Venn diagram, according to lesson number two, I have told that no conclusion is always wrong. In this lesson number three, if all the parameters are inside a single Venn diagram, possibility is always true. So, friends, listen carefully, which is most important. If all the parameters are inside a single Venn diagram, no conclusion is false. If all the parameters are inside a single Venn diagram, possibility conclusion is true. So lesson number two opposite is lesson number three. So let me move on to all the five different questions so that you can able to understand the concept of possibility clearly. So before going for the question, so first of all, you should know how to draw the possibility diagram. That is important because some students will think that this possible diagram is correct or this possible diagram is wrong. So they don't know how to draw the possible diagram. So first of all, let me see a possible diagram for a question. Then we can move on to all the various questions that is based on possible conclusion. Now we can learn how to draw the possible diagram for this statement, right? So let me move on to the simple question. So friends, listen here, some tree or paper, all papers are car and no car is stuck. So let me draw the Venn diagram for the given statement, right? So some paper, some tree or paper. So some tree or paper and all papers are car and the last statement is no car is stuck. So friends, this diagram which we used to call it as a basic diagram. So what are all the possible diagram that we can draw by using this statement? So friends, listen here. I can, this is the basic diagram, right? So this will be the basic. So let me move on to all the possible diagram friends. So possible diagram is, I can draw like this because they have, in the statement they have clearly told that there should not be any connection between car and truck. But we can connect the truck to the tree, right? So this is one possible diagram. So I can draw truck here and i can draw tree here and also this can be a paper and this can be a car so this can be one possible diagram so friends always remember that you can draw whatever diagram by using the statement but you should not violate the statement that is important so after drawing this possible diagram check the statement whether you have drawn the diagram correctly some tree or paper some tree or paper all papers are car all papers are car and no car is truck there is no link between car and truck 
So according to the statement, we have drawn the diagram, so which we used to call it as a possible diagram. This will be the basic diagram and this is the possible diagram. So we have not violated the statement. So we can say that it is one of the possible diagram. So let me move on to the second possible diagram, friends. You can draw various types of possible diagram, but remember that every time while drawing a diagram, you should not violate the statement. That is important, right? So this can be drawn as a tree, truck, a pen, sorry, it's a paper, right? So paper and car. So friends, this can be also called as an another possible diagram. So listen here, some tree or paper. So some tree or paper, all papers are car, all papers are car and no car is truck. There is no link between car and truck. So we can say that this is one of the possible diagram. So it is your wish. You can draw various types of possible diagram, but listen carefully. You should not violate the statement, right? Some students say this is one of the possible diagram. Listen here friends. Most of the students will make a mistake. They used to draw like this tree and uh, paper and car and they used to draw like this and uh, this is stuck right and they used to say this is one of the possible diagram whether this is possible this possible diagram is correct or wrong exactly wrong this is not the possible diagram for the given statement why because some tree or paper statement number one satisfies all papers are car all papers are car statement number two satisfy but when we see statement number three no car is truck there should not be any connection between car and truck but according to the possible diagram that we drawn here all cars are truck but the statement is no car is truck we have violated the statement so this is not the possible diagram you can draw diagram as per your wish you can draw car here you can draw paper here so everything is your wish in the possible diagram but remember that whatever diagram that you are going to draw you should not violate the statement that is important so let me move on to all the five questions that is based on this possibility case question number one so the statements are some papers are pen so some papers are pen and the second statement is all pen are scale so all pen or scale and the last statement is no scale is a marker so the meaning is there is no connection between scale and a marker so friends finally we have drawn the venn diagram for the given statements so let me move on to conclusion number one so some marker being paper is a possibility so the conclusion that is based on possibility so friends if the conclusion that is based on possibility you need to draw the basic diagram and you need to draw the possible diagram if it satisfies in any one diagram then the answer is correct so let me move on to conclusion number one friends some marker being paper is a possibility so this is the basic diagram so according to the basic diagram there is no connection between paper and a marker right but they are saying that some marker being paper right so according to the basic diagram paper there is no link between marker and paper so according to the basic diagram the conclusion is wrong when we move on to the possible diagram and according to the statement they have clearly told that no scale is a marker there is no connection between scale and marker but we can connect this marker with the paper there is a possible of connecting marker with the paper so when we connect marker with the paper it satisfies the conclusion some marker being paper is a possibility and here some marker being paper is a possibility so we can say that in a possible diagram the conclusion follows if it is true in any one diagram then the answer is true so in basic diagram conclusion is false but in possible diagram the answer is true so if it is true in any one diagram the answer is true so finally we can say that conclusion number one is true so friends listen carefully no scale is marker but we can connect the marker to with the paper right and when we connect the marker with the paper it satisfies the conclusion some marker being paper is a possibility so friends, whenever you draw a diagram you should not violate the statement that is important so if if some some students will think whether this diagram is correct or not if you think like that just read the statement again some papers are pen <coughs> So some paper are pen, statement number one is correct. Statement number two, all pens are scale. So all pen are scale. Statement number three, no scale is a marker. No scale is a marker. So the possible diagram is correct and it satisfies the conclusion. So we can say that conclusion number one is true. So let me move on to conclusion number two. Okay. 
so friends conclusion number two all marker being paper is a possibility so friends listen here all marker being paper is a possibility so according to the basic diagram there is no link between paper and marker so according to the basic diagram the conclusion is false when we move on to the possible diagram listen carefully friends so all marker being paper is a possible so if I draw a marker like this assume that I am drawing a marker like this this is one of the possible diagram if I draw the marker like this then we can surely say that all marker being paper is a possibility so it satisfies the possible diagram if it is true in any one diagram then the answer is true so friends listen carefully most important concept concentrate on conclusion number two all marker being paper is a possibility and I am drawing marker here so all marker being paper is a possible so we can say that according to possible diagram conclusion follows after drawing the possible diagram if you want you need to check with the statement whether the diagram is correct or not just read the statement again some paper are pen some papers are pen all pens are scale so all pens are scale no scale is marker there is no connection between scale and marker so according to the statement the diagram that we drawn is correct and also all markers being paper is a possibility it satisfies the conclusion so we can say that conclusion number two follows so for this question the answer is conclusion number one and conclusion number two is true question number two and the statement number one is some tree or paper so some tree or paper and the second statement is some papers are pen so some paper or pen all pens are car so all pens are car and the last statement is all cars are truck and the last is no truck is cycle so the meaning of no truck is cycle there is no connection between truck and cycle so let me draw cycle here so this line indicates that there is no connection between truck and cycle so friends finally we have drawn the Venn diagram for the given statement right so let me move on to conclusion number one so all cycles being paper is a possibility so the conclusion that is based on possibility right so all cycles being paper so friends according to the basic diagram there is no connection between paper and a cycle so it does not satisfy the conclusion so we can say that according to basic diagram conclusion number one is false when we move on to the possible diagram all cycle being paper is a possible we need to check whether this is possible or not so friends listen carefully according to the statement they have clearly told that no truck is cycle there is no connection between truck and cycle but there is a possible of connecting cycle with paper and there is a possible of connecting cycle with tree i can draw a cycle here this is also one possible if i draw a cycle here just read the conclusion again all cycle being paper is a possibility it's correct or not so we can say that with this possible diagram we can surely say that conclusion follows if it is true in any one diagram then the answer is true so we can say that conclusion number one is true some students will think whether this diagram is correct or not if you think like that just so we have drawn a possible diagram like this right and it satisfies all cycle being paper as a possibility it satisfies if you think whether this diagram is correct or not just read the statement again and check whether we have violated the statement or not statement number one some tree or paper some tree or paper statement number two some papers are pen some papers are pen statement number three all pen are car all pen are car and statement number four all car are truck and the last statement no truck is cycle there is no connection between truck and cycle in the possible diagram which is correct so we have not violated the statement and the possible diagram is correct and also it satisfies the conclusion so finally we can say that conclusion number one is true so let me move on to second conclusion okay so conclusion number two some tree being cycle is a possible so some tree being cycle is definitely possible look at your friends in the basic diagram there is no connection between tree and cycle so according to basic diagram conclusion 2 is false so when we move on to the possible diagram there is a possible of drawing a cycle like this right so when we draw a cycle like this this region we can say that some tree or cycle and the conclusion says trumps some tree being cycle is a possible so we can definitely say that some tree being cycle is a possible so in the possible diagram it satisfies if it is true in any one diagram then the conclusion is true so we can say that conclusion number two is true so let me move on to conclusion number three okay conclusion number three some cycle being car is a possibility friends the conclusion number three is most important conclusion listen carefully some cycle being car is a possibility so friends when the according to the basic diagram there is no connection between cycle and car 
but the conclusion says some cycle being car so according to basic diagram conclusion does not follow that is conclusion is false when we move on to the possible diagram there is no possible of connecting cycle with car because we already know that no truck is cycle we should not connect truck and cycle so where car pen all are inside the truck so there is no possible of connecting cycle with car and the conclusion says some cycle being car it is definitely not possible there is no possible of connecting some cycle or car so in the possible diagram also it is false so if it is false in both the diagram then the conclusion is false so friends can you able to understand this concept we can connect the cycle with paper we can connect cycle with tree but there is no possible of connecting cycle with truck and there is no possible of connecting cycle with car and also there is no possible of connecting cycle with pen so according to the possible diagram also there is no possible of connecting car and a cycle so in possible diagram it is false and basic diagram it is false if it is false in both the diagram then the answer is false so let me move on to the last conclusion so the last conclusion is all cycle being pen is a possibility again all cycle being pen is definitely not possible we know that there is no connection between cycle and pen in the basic diagram so it does not satisfy the conclusion when we move on to the possible diagram there is no possible of connecting cycle and pen but the conclusion says all cycle being pen that is also not possible in both the diagram where the conclusion is false so we can say that conclusion number four is false so finally for this question the answer is conclusion number one and conclusion number two is true question number three so the statement number one is all cakes are sweet so all cake are sweet and uh, the second statement is no sweet is chocolate so no sweet is chocolate okay so there is no connection between sweet and chocolate and the third statement is all sweets are good so all sweets are good so friends listen carefully here there is no connection between sweet and chocolate right so all sweets are good and the last statement is some goods are best so some goods are best so friends finally we have drawn the venn diagram for the given statement so let me move on to conclusion number one so conclusion number one is all chocolates being best is a possibility so here it is chocolate and here it is best so according to the basic diagram there is no connection between chocolate and best so according to basic diagram we can say that conclusion is false but when we move on to the possible diagram all chocolates being best is a possibility so friends listen carefully we can draw chocolate here right so when we draw chocolate here all chocolates being best is a possibility and we have not violated the statement why because read the statement again all cakes are sweet and no sweet is chocolate so there is no link between sweet and chocolate and the next is all sweets are good and some some goods are best so friends we have not violated the statement so it satisfies the conclusion because all chocolates being best is a possibility so in the possible diagram where conclusion is true so if it is true in any one diagram then the answer is true so finally we can say that conclusion number one is true so let me move on to conclusion number two okay draw chocolates here okay friends conclusion number two all chocolates being good is a possibility friends all chocolates being good is a possible so according to the basic diagram there is no connection between good and chocolate so according to basic diagram our conclusion 2 is false when we move on to the possible diagram listen carefully they have clearly told that there is no connection between sweet and chocolate but we can connect chocolate with best and we can connect chocolate with good so the conclusion says all chocolate being good is a possibility we can definitely say that when we draw chocolate here so friends remember that if i am drawing chocolate here right so so ju just check whether we have drawn the diagram correctly or not right so some all cakes are sweet so all cakes are sweet all sweets are good all sweets are good and no sweet is chocolate no sweet is chocolate there is no connection between sweet and chocolate and the last statement is some goods are best so friends we have not violated the statement and it satisfies the conclusion the conclusion is all chocolates being good is a possibility all chocolates being good is a possibility so we have not violated the statement and it satisfies the conclusion so we can say that in the possible diagram conclusion follows if it is true in any one diagram then the answer is true so finally we can say that conclusion number two is true okay so let me move on to conclusion number three okay friends conclusion number three is 
all goods being chocolate is a possibility so friends all goods being chocolate is a possible so according to basic diagram there is no connection between good and chocolate so we can say that according to basic diagram where the conclusion is false so friends when we move on to the possible diagram all goods should be a chocolate right so only if i need to satisfy the conclusion then the chocolate should be like this right so if we draw chocolate like this then we can say that all goods being chocolate is correct so friends listen carefully only if we draw a chocolate like this we can say that all goods being chocolate is a possible but when we draw a chocolate like this they have clearly told that there should not be any connection between sweet and chocolate but when we draw a possible diagram like this then all sweet becomes chocolate so there is no possible of drawing all goods are chocolate so in the possible diagram also it is false so if it is false in both the diagram then the answer is false so friends listen carefully all chocolates being good is a possible but all goods being chocolate is not at all possible friends can you able to understand this concept one of the most important concept we can draw chocolate here if we draw chocolate here all chocolates being good is a possibility but if you need to satisfy all goods being chocolate is a possible so only chances to draw the diagram like this when we draw chocolate like this there will be a connection between sweet and the chocolate and in the statement itself they have clearly told that there should not be any connection between sweet and chocolate so finally we can say that all goods being chocolate is not at all possible so we can say that in both the diagram it is not true so the conclusion is false so let me move on to the last conclusion that is conclusion number four okay so conclusion number four some chocolates being cake is a possibility some chocolates being cake is a possible so according to the basic diagram there is no connection between chocolate and the cake so we can say that in the basic diagram conclusion does not follow and in a possible diagram also we already know that there is no connection between sweet and chocolate so we can definitely say that there is no possible of connecting chocolate with cake and the conclusion says some chocolates being cake so in the possible diagram itself there is no possible of connecting chocolate and cake so we can say that the possible diagram also it is false so if it is false in both the diagram then the answer is false so friends listen carefully so finally we got an answer that is conclusion number one and conclusion number two is true so friends after drawing a venn diagram just think for a while what are all the possible diagram that we can draw right so here no sweet is chocolate there is no possible of connecting sweet and chocolate if there is no possible of connecting sweet and chocolate and we can surely say that there is no possible of connecting chocolate with cake but there is a possible of connecting chocolate with best and there is a possible of connecting chocolate with good the most important concept is conclusion number two and conclusion number three is most important because conclusion number two all chocolates being good is a possible but all goods being chocolate is not at all possible so let me move on to question number four question number four so some blue or green right so some blue or green and the second statement is some green or pink so some green or pink and the third statement is all pink or yellow so all pink or yellow and next is no yellow is black and some black are red so no yellow is black right so we can draw black here so no yellow is black and some blacks are red so friends finally we have drawn the venn diagram for the given statement so friends listen here they have clearly told that there is no connection between yellow and black right so friends after drawing this diagram just analyze it right what are all the possible diagram that we can draw so friends listen here there is no connection between black and yellow but there is a possible of connecting black with green and there is a possible of connecting black with blue and there is no possible of connecting black with pink and the second is uh, there is a possible of connecting red with yellow there is a possible of connecting red with pink there is a possible of connecting red with green and there is a possible of connecting red with blue so friends let me move on to the conclusion so conclusion number one some red being yellow is a possibility so it's based on possibility conclusion so you need to draw the basic and the possible diagram right so some red being yellow so friends here it is red and here it is yellow so there is no link between red and yellow so in the basic diagram conclusion does not follow let me move on to the possible diagram so friends some red being yellow is a possible i think when we draw red like this listen carefully friends so when we draw red like this then we can surely say that some red being yellow is a possibility and we have not violated the statement because read the statement again some blue or green 
and some green or pink all pink are yellow right so no yellow is black there is no connection between yellow and black so no yellow is black and some blacks are red so we can definitely say that we have not violated the statement and it satisfies the conclusion so some red being yellow is a possibility so in the possible diagram conclusion one satisfies so if if it is satisfies in any one diagram then the answer is correct so conclusion number one is true so let me move on to conclusion number two so we can draw like this okay so friends conclusion number two is all red being blue is a possible so all red being blue is definitely possible why because we can draw like this listen here friends the conclusion says all red being blue is a possible so if we in, in the basic diagram there is no connection between red and blue so we can say that according to basic diagram where the conclusion does not follow but when we move on to the possible diagram we can draw like this right so this can be red and this can be black so this is also one possible diagram listen carefully friends so i'm saying that this is one of the possible diagrams just read the statement again whether we have violated the statement or not some blue or green some green or pink all pink are yellow and no yellow is black there should not be any link between yellow and black so in this diagram there is no link between yellow and black and some blacks are red so we have not violated the statement so the diagram is a possible diagram so in this diagram the conclusion says all red being blue is a possible so in this diagram all red being blue is a possibility so in the possibility diagram where the conclusion is true so if it is true in any one diagram then the answer is true so finally we can say that for this question number four the answer is conclusion number one is true and conclusion number two is true so friends listen carefully you should be strong on the concept and you should practice more number of questions nearly 50 to 60 questions so if you practice more than 50 or 60 questions that is only based on possibility you will definitely crack all the question is based on possibility so friends let me move on to the last question that is fifth question i think fifth question we are going to apply the second rule i think in the initial stage of a video itself i have told you right if all the parameters are inside a single venn diagram possibility always follows so let me move on to question number five the last fifth question so some papers are switched so some paper or switch and the second is some switch are book so some switch are book and all books are note so all book or note then all note are pen so all note are pen and some pens are scale so some pens are scale so friends finally we have drawn the venn diagram for the given statement so friends listen carefully ear paper switch book note pen and scale so all the parameters are inside a single venn diagram right we can say that here all the parameters are inside a single venn diagram if all the parameters are inside a single venn diagram if you find any conclusion that is based on possibility it is always true listen here friends the conclusion number one some papers are scale is a possibility so some papers are scale where paper and scale so all are inside a single venn diagram possibility follows don't check whether it is a basic diagram possible diagram true or false if it is in a single venn diagram always possibility is true conclusion number two some paper being note some paper being note again it is possible so friends listen carefully there is a small difference between lesson number two and lesson number three in lesson number two that is based on no conclusion if all the parameters are inside a single venn diagram no conclusion is false if all the parameters are inside a single venn diagram possibility conclusion is true that is the difference between lesson number two and lesson number three so friends finally in this lesson number three we have solved uh, five different questions on the topic syllogism the conclusion that is based on possibility so friends after watching lesson number one lesson number two lesson number three take your books and practice many questions that is based on possibility and practice more number of questions that is based on no sum and all so after practicing all these conclusion then go and watch lesson number four that is based on sum not conclusion so friends thank you so much for watching this video if you really like this share this to your friends those who are preparing for a competitive exam so that the videos will be so helpful for them so thank you so much for watching this video bye